doing today? Welcome to the Bills of Show. Today on the Bills of Show, it's day five, and uh, she's totally positive today. I'm gonna go for a little drive, self-contained in my truck, not touch anybody. Got to pick up my check and my paperwork, boys. Friggin' regular dude. So we're gonna go do that right now, and I should actually grab some friggin' gloves because I need gas. Someone's like a gas when I'm out and everything else, right? I need gas, I need some propane, so I can make myself a nice big steak of rooski. Hey, who wants a steak of rooski with dirty old bells? You do, freaking right you do. So we'll open the door up, I'll be right back, boys, just gonna grab my gloves. Always remember to have your gloves, boys, if you need gas, eh? Never put, get gas without glove skis on, frig no. So what's everybody's plans to do today? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe and like, hit that notification bell bar button. And we can all live together, we can. Just of course through the camera, not, you know, actually live together if you know what I'm saying but I'm gonna come home today and it's nice out it's not too bad it's about five out today it's gonna hit not sunny though it's kind of dark out but I'm gonna sort of self quarantine myself to the yard I am that way you get out in the air and it makes you feel better and you don't get all depressed from sitting at home how many of you are sitting at home right now think what the hell am I gonna do on board do you have a house do you have an apartment what's the deal Leo inquiring minds want to know that inquiring mind is my mind right now freaking right we try to stay positive throughout this boys We'll get through her. We will. They look busy down there. Frick. No call-ins for me today, hey? I didn't get any, uh, I'm stopping just so you know. My on-call is not on-call, hey? Even though I'm not really on-call, I'm just on an emergency if they can't figure something out or need a hand or... I had another job offer today I did, but I said no, because they found out I was on, I was laid off, so they called me and said, hey, do you want a job? I'm like, no, I'm good. Thanks, so appreciate it. Frig, never heard of somebody hiring during a crisis before, but hey, it is what it is, boys. I'm pretty much a gold glass and accessory guy, I am. So far. So far, as long as everything goes right. So we're gonna hobble into town here, get her check, get her paperwork, and then I'll be back. Because there's no sense in driving down here and screaming at the camera because of the wind noise, as you can hear. Oh, we got gas, we did, and it was at 60 cents a liter, which is the cheapest it's been in probably 10 years, boys. He's freaking crazy. Stop by over work there, grab the old check rooski and they don't have much going on. They don't. Just enough to pay them and the bills. Why wouldn't it be? Old Dave looks like he's off too, eh? Are you off there, Dave? You watching this? Anyways, I'm gonna slip up here now and we'll go to Sims Propane and get some propane, propane, propane. Hey. Just that way I can cook something, boys. It cost me $29 to fill my truck, boys, from half a tank. 29 Canadian. That's, that's crazy. So that means it cost me 50 bucks to fill this zone, bitch, which normally cost me 130. Wow. And then I, of course, got high test for the old cherry can. 20 liters, boys. I got 21 liters, and it cost me $10.32. So if you're wondering what 22 liters is, that's like five gallons, I think. Five gallons for 10 bucks. A deal. Freaking, so many cuts on my hand. I'm using this damn hand sanitizer, boys. I'm telling you right now, it's just cocking me right over. My hands are on fire right now from all the cuts and stuff. Stuff is harsh, it is. Thank God I tied up my gas tank back there. It'll be gone on this road. She'd be a slosh sloshing, boys. Girls, be old. So the daughter and mother want to go for a drive they do down river. Has no we'll pack a lunch and we'll go for a rip. Make some sandwiches, go for a drive, we will. That sounds like a great idea, actually. Here comes a train, boys. But I'm not waiting for it because he's just barely moving and I'll be fitting here all friggin' day. For cakes. But you know what that means? If I didn't have to get propane, I'd catch a train at home. She's a normal one. We got trains out our asses around here. Anyways, enough of that. This channel isn't for trains. Apologize. Don't forget to get over there and subscribe and like that channel. Why wouldn't you? If you like trains. Decent. That's it, boys. Just one quick little stab for you. Gotta do what I gotta do, I do. But don't forget to leave a comment down below, seriously, and let me know what the hell you're doing, because I need to know. Because without needing to know, there's no purpose of me doing anything on here. It's called interaction with my fans. If I don't have interaction, and I'm just one of those YouTubers that don't reply to nothing, then what's the point of me even doing it, boys? Girls, peoples. And get your wives to subscribe, too, because I haven't I've got, I haven't got any females. It's all males, hey? Whole bunch of friggin' dicks watching this there is. What the hell's really going on? Frick! I guess I'm not the ladies' man, eh? Sorry about that, girls. I apologize. The dirty old rotten old stinky old Bill. Well, I'm not stinky. I had a shower this morning. Stinky old Bill of uh, ain't the lady type he's done. God darn it. No houses around except for a trailer park back here and we're doing 50. Don't forget, if you're pumping gas and you use your debit card and you got gloves on, don't forget to sterilize your card, boys, because if you don't, what's the point, eh? So give it a wipe down when you get in the truck. 
what I do, this is what I do. Okay, this is going to sound stupid, and I don't know why you're bothering, because I have hand sanitizer, so it's the same shit. I should just hand sanitize everything. But anyways. This is what I do for the hell of it. I put these gloves on, I pump my gas, I paint the pumps, I hang up the thingamabobber, take my hand sanitizer, out of the truck, I rub on my hands, I rub on my door handle, I rub my card down, I rub my phone down, I rub the steering wheel, and then I take my gloves off and throw them away. Right? <laughs> and that's how she goes, Jim. I don't know if they're open here or not. We're going to find out shortly we are. So there you go. If anybody wants propane, Sims Propane's a place to go. It is. Friggin' right it is. Boys, girls, peoples. Do something. Don't get your hand up. Don't get your cock. A little bit of... Oh, yeah. Fucking right it is. Do it. Always sterilize your cock, boys. You don't want to think you old ball sack, you don't. Right, girls? That was a good little drive coming to town. Cost me a hundred bucks. Well, not really. 50, 50 for three bottles of propane filled up 20 pound, 20 pounders. That's pretty decent. So 50 bucks, 60, 70, 80, 90, 90 bucks today. 90, $94 and change actually is what it is. So that's not bad. And I got full tank of lawnmower fuel, high test. I got a full tank of regular fuel in the old Chakarooski. And I got three bottles of propane for 90 bucks. Leave your comments below if you think I did good. Why wouldn't you? Why the hell wouldn't you? Anyways, let's mosey on home here. We'll get this stuff unloaded, and then we'll go on to our next doodad. Well, boys, I'm taking advantage of being off I am. I'm outside, and I'm going to vacuum out the back of the Silverado. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> I think I just might have shit myself. I did. Hey, why wouldn't I? But hey, if you're... Automatic turn on, boys. But hey, if you're home like I am, and you're bored, and sitting inside, get off your butt, go clean your car. I live in a freaking apartment. Good old bed rugs, boys. You want to get yourself one? Go see those guys' accessories after two weeks. There we go. Good enough. Hey, this is the box bed for crying out loud. Look at that, boys. Decent. Finally got the family motivated to go somewhere. It only took me like freaking a half an hour. Kids just sitting on the TV all damn day. I'm outside working my butt off. Stacy's in there disinfecting everything again. And kids just sitting on the couch doing nothing. Oh man, kids, I tell you. Forced. You gotta force her to go for a drive. We're not going anywhere. We're not going into public. We're just getting in my truck. We're gonna go out to Wallaceburg, go for a drive down river, and that's about it, boys. Like, what's really going on? Damn kids nowadays, I tell you. Anyways, I'm just waiting for them to get out here and then we'll get rolling. And if I see anything on the way, we'll show you. And I'll talk to you and we'll do this and that and the other freaking thing. How high the water level is here in Walpool Island, boys, girls, peoples. Hey, that whole thing is a field over there and it's all flooded. Freaking crazy. I'm going to take a little ride up here and I'll show you up at the bridge. Hey, look at the water level, Jim. That's freaking awesome. Hello, how you doing? Hey, how you doing? Decent. There's a, a lighthouse down here. Where did it go? Right there. Look at it. Just out in the middle of nowhere doing something. Friggin' right it is. But uh, it's pretty nice long here. I haven't been down here in years. But over there somewhere is America. That's not America. That's America. Well, we're just heading back home now. Stopped at uh, Corona there and got some chicken breast and some porky choppies. Gonna have myself some baked potatoes tonight and something else probably. Or maybe I'll have chicken parmesan. I don't know yet. We haven't decided, have we? I thought we were gonna have hamburgers. No, yeah, we could have hamburgers too, but I'm thinking that I like what I'm saying better. But anyways, we're gonna go home here and uh, do this side of the other thing. So hopefully everybody's having a good day like I am, staying uh, isolated in your own vehicle. Like we are. Stay safe, don't do anything I wouldn't do, and uh, you know what to do for now. 